Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Lithuania is advancing its defense capabilities with plans to acquire several high-profile military systems, underscoring its commitment to national and regional security amidst increasing geopolitical tensions. The Lithuanian Minister of Defense, Lorinas Kasijunas, announced the country's intention to purchase the Iris T air defense system from Germany, a decision influenced by the system's proven effectiveness in Ukraine. During a press conference in Palanga with his German counterpart, Boris Pistorius, Kasijunas emphasized Lithuania's strategic military enhancements. Among these, the acquisition of 55 Leopard 2 main battle tanks stands out. These tanks are set to form a new battalion, bolstering Lithuania's armored capabilities significantly. Additionally, the Iris T SLM system, a medium-range air defense solution, will further fortify Lithuania's defense infrastructure. This decision aligns Lithuania with its Baltic neighbors, Estonia and Latvia, who previously announced their joint procurement of the same system from Deal Defense last year. German Minister of Defense Pistorius highlighted Lithuania's interest in the Skyranger anti-aircraft tank. The Lithuanian armed forces already utilize the Boxer armored wheeled vehicle for troop transport, and the Sky Ranger, designed to be mounted on the Boxer, will soon be delivered to the Bundeswehr. This synergy points to a broader trend of interoperability between German and Lithuanian forces, a crucial factor given the planned deployment of a German combat brigade to Lithuania in 2027. Further bolstering its ground capabilities, Lithuania is exploring the acquisition of the Martyr Infantry Fighting Vehicle. However, this potential purchase hinges on the availability of these vehicles from the Bundeswehr. The emphasis on interoperability underscores the strategic partnership between Lithuania and Germany, aimed at enhancing the collective defense posture of NATO forces in the region. Lithuania's drive to upgrade its military assets is largely driven by security concerns related to its geographical position. Sandwiched between Belarus and the Russian exclave of Kaliningrad, Lithuania finds itself at the heart of a highly strategic and sensitive region. The Suvalki Corridor, a narrow land strip linking the Baltic states to the rest of NATO, is a focal point of military tension. This corridor's vulnerability necessitates robust defensive measures to deter potential aggression from Russia and Belarus. The Lithuanian government's proactive steps in strengthening its defense capabilities reflect a broader regional trend of heightened military preparedness in response to perceived threats from Russia. By investing in advanced systems like the Iris TSLM and modernizing its armored forces, Lithuania aims to ensure its sovereignty and contribute to the collective security of the Baltic region and NATO allies. As these developments unfold, the collaboration between Lithuania and Germany serves as a testament to the enduring importance of strategic alliances and the continuous evolution of defense strategies to address emerging security challenges in Europe. That's all for now. See you later.